So I buy power sent me their gamer paladin to check out and boy was I excited. Not only was Big Red already due for an upgrade, but their Gamer Paladin PC that they sent me has some pretty beefy specs. It came equipped with an i7-6800K 6-core processor which I overclocked to 4.6GHz at 1.25V guys, that's a full 1GHz overclock with a low core voltage. They did throw in 16 gigs of RAM from G-Skill which I also overclocked to 3200MHz and their very own CPU cooling system. For storage I have a 256GB Samsung 950 Pro SSD as my main and a WD Black 2TB hard drive. The motherboard of choice is the MSI X99A SLI Plus with a neutral black PCB and finally we have an EVGA GTX 1080 Superclock graphics card. By the way, huge thanks to EVGA for supplying the graphics card and the 850 watt power supply that's juicing up this entire system. Now the case, that's a different story. They're calling it the Element. It's a custom modded S340 case with tempered glass windows for the side and front. It's easily one of the cleanest and stunning cases I have ever seen and I just had to have this on my desk. It even has red LEDs glowing from underneath and inside the case. There's actually an RGB strip on the top that allows me to change the color or give it some pretty cool effects. Personally, I think that an MSI GPU would go better with the color scheme, but overall, I'm very satisfied with the build and cable management. In terms of acoustics, this is a very silent PC. Before, I couldn't turn on Big Red behind me while recording a video because of all that fan noise, but now, well, now it's not an issue. In terms of performance, well, if you watch my GTX 1080 for the win review, then you can see the performance of the 1080 Super Clocked as well, because there's really not much of a difference between the two. But I'm sitting here playing Doom maxed out at 3440 by 1440p and getting over 100 frames per second. This thing is a beast for gaming and it does very well on the productivity side as well. Needless to say, this is going to be my main rig at the moment until I have enough time to do a ridiculous high-end water-cooled build early next year. Whoa, 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 hold on a second, you guys might be asking. Ed, I thought you were against pre-built PCs, why on earth are you promoting this on your channel? Good question. I'm against overpriced pre-built PCs and considering that most of them are, iBuyPower is actually one of the very few if not the only company that doesn't overprice their PCs. And here's the proof. So I managed to gather up all of the same or equivalent parts used in this exact same build and it came out to a little under 2100. The total cost of the Gamer Paladin on iBuyPower is 2324. Now keep in mind that the extra difference that you are paying for is in their 3 year warranty, custom modded case that's not available anywhere, along with some other mods like the LED fans, RGB strips and custom red sleeving. Not to mention the time it takes for them to build the PC. On top of all that you also get your free mouse, keyboard and headset with your purchase. So if you add all these up, the total cost of the actual custom PC would be around $2250 which is pretty much the same cost as a pre-built gamer paladin. The huge difference here is that you have peace of mind knowing that if your PC were to have problems, that iBuyPower is right there to help you out. Honestly, I don't know how these guys managed to build a very powerful and good looking PC with pretty much the same cost as retail. I feel like they are more targeted towards beginners who don't know how to build one themselves yet or for people that just don't have the time or patience to learn how to build one. But with that said, I'll go ahead and drop a link to the Gamer Paladin down below if you guys want to check that out or other PCs from iBuyPower. Uh, but whichever PC you guys go with, you're definitely getting your money's worth. I pretty much proved that in this video. Once again, a huge thanks to iBuyPower for sending this in and sponsoring this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I will see you in the next video.